Ah, the sword you carry is different since I last saw you. Yes, I see it is much improved. To think, the goddess's chosen hero is but a mere boy. Quite a twist. Chosen hero or not, you do not yet possess the strength required to wield the full pow power of that blade. You must train yourself further. Devote yourself wholly to this task. Oh. Farewell, boy. Hey everybody, this is Paladin from Pal Plays, and today we are Pal playing Skyward Sword. I don't know. In the last episode, we defeated Kalectos and got this ancient cistern and that giant fish out of our lives for good. And in this episode, we're going up to Skyloft to do some side questy stuff. Um, it's probably not what you want to hear, but that's what we're doing. And don't worry, this time, I know what I'm doing. Um, I kind of made, that was cool, I kind of made a mistake a couple, well, a while ago when I challenged myself to play through this game without guides and that is this game is not just for myself me this run through of this game is not just through for myself it's for you guys as well and it was kind of selfish of me to make you guys suffer through this while I did too so this time I am going through the Skyloft side quests that was weird with a uh, with a guide so, let's get to it. But before we do, there is something over here. Oh, I think it's a goddess wall. Well, anyway. Okay, let's actually... What we want to do first is something I want to show before we leave the Farron Woods. And that is a heart piece... That is this way. Pretty sure it's this way. Yeah, it's this way. And I want to get this before we're here next, because we're going to be... Next time we're back here is going to be a long time from now. And I want to go ahead and grab this heart piece while we still can. Okay, so we want to go through the sealed grounds. And we want to go see Gorko. He should be somewhere over here. He should be up here. Yeah, there he is. He has a quest bubble. This is not a gratitude quest, crystal quest. This is just a heart container thing. Yugen, eh? Uh, um, oh, you you would probably want to know that I've seen some Blissed butterflies flying around here lately. Too bad I have no musical talent whatsoever. Yep, I could not make a beautiful tone to save my life. Okay, can we do that? And he'll see? Maybe? Hopefully, please say yes. Yay, good. Whoa, I think my heart stopped! This is it, the discovery of a lifetime! There's no mistaking it. This is it, kid. This symbol must mark one, must mark one of the goddess walls left for the hero by the goddess. Okay. There's no mistaking it. Oh. Okay, so I'm guessing we need to... Glimmering Hexagon. Glimmering Hexagon. Ah, rupees. Okay. Ye who seek gr great riches, draw this shape so that it may be known. Okay. Well, that's what is written here. Does that, does that mean anything to you? Yes, rupees. Let's go. Okay, Glimmering hexagon, that is that, 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 and that. Please work. Yay! Silver rupee again! Sweet money bags! So that's what it meant by great riches. For helping me out with my research, I would like to give you a little something. You got a piece of heart. Collect four to increase your heart capacity by one. Two to go. Hey. The magical power of the goddess walls returns after a little time has passed. So come by and help me with my research again sometime, okay? Okay. Let's... Whoa, that was freaky. He disappeared. 
he, well, he teleported over there. And we got a silver rupee, which we're going to actually need. Yes, we have five, six hundred rupees, but we actually do need it. So, um, I will meet you in Skyloft, but first, I will actually go get a tumbleweed. I'll be right back. So, um, on my way here, I actually stopped by Laneru Desert to pick up a tumbleweed, and off screen, I bought and upgraded some stuff. I'll actually show it in the upper right hand corner right now. Um, first of all, I bought at Beatles a new place in our inventory, or our our adventure pouch, yeah, that's the name. And I also upgraded a shield, but you guys don't get to know which shield until we find out where we're going next. I also upgrade, upgraded our beetle. We now have the tough beetle. It can stay out longer and it can take more hits. Um, no other upgrades besides that. Three, four, five hits. It can take five hits now. And something cool I noticed is, look at on the back of it, you have the infinity symbol. That's a really good touch. So that now that we have that, let's go ahead and actually go to the Isle of Songs. We see uh, there's a goddess chest there, but we won't bother to get that yet. And also, you're probably wondering what kind of side quest stuff we're going to be doing. Um, not much. It's only going to be this episode, and this episode might just be a short, a short one too, if um, if we do things fast. So. There, it isn't nearly as bad as it was uh, last time, so you don't have to worry about that. Um, actually, we don't have many side quests to go for the rest of the game either, so there's another thing that you can be happy about. So, but there is, actually, in, in the Stormhead, there is... Take down these useless beacons. There is one goddess chest right there. So we're going to collect that first. I'm actually recording this on Easter Sunday, so it's actually really quiet around my house. You know, it's Sunday's kind of the the relax nap day. I I think it's you know it's the day that everyone sets aside. Everyone that I know sets aside just to kind of you know relax before entering the next week. But I usually choose this day to record. It's actually not in my recording schedule to record on Sundays, but I really have nothing else to do. Um, and I'm not one- I don't really like- <laughs> Poor bird. <laughs> he just collided, like, twice. I really don't like just relaxing on a Sunday. I want to be doing something, whether it's playing video games or recording. I want to do something. So that rupee medal will probably actually replace our, um, our heart medal. Actually, no, wait, we can just keep it like this. So we can just head on to the Isle of Song, since we have nothing else to do in the stor storm head right now. It's really, I, that's probably a complaint I have about this area. It's kind of barren. I mean, look, if you look at the map, it, there are only a couple islands that are interesting. This one, which doesn't have any significance yet. Isle of Songs, which is just for, um... It's just for the story. And this, which I think we just finished everything in it. There really aren't that many interesting islands in here. And I would like... This is something that I think would have been nice. In this game, if they had put... Poor bird. If they had put some more, um... Some more NPC, you know, talking people's islands out here. I mean, there's the Lumpy Pumpkin, but that's really only a couple people. And it's not, you know, it's a place of business. It's not a home. I wish they had another place besides just Skyloft. It could be smaller, but it would be nice. So, to just to interrupt my ramblings, let's go ahead and hit this. The symbol of the goddess will show you the way, Master. It will react to being struck by your Skyward Strike. Okay. So we'll do that and get a new s song. I'm 
Master Link, I have important information. When you struck the crest with a skyward strike from your sword, a message from the goddess awakened deep within my memory. The goddess intended this message for you, Master. These are her words. He who seeks the sacred flames, listen well, for I am the one guiding you from my place at the edge of time. Two sacred flames remain. Should you desire to possess them, you must obtain the other sacred gifts. For each trial you overcome, you will be blessed with another gift. Harness the power of these gifts, 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 and let there be no doubt that you shall find yourself standing before the majesty of the sacred flames. Now, I give you another melody. It will serve as a key to unlocking your next trial, which awaits you, which awaits you within the shifting sands of Laneru Desert. You have no idea how hard it is for me to refrain from humming. The song you just heard, heard is called Naru, uh, Naru's Liv Wisdom. Use this song of knowledge to find the next trial. You learn Nar Naru's Wisdom. I keep wanting to say Naru's. Oh, that's going to be a thing now. I have memorized Naru's wisdom for you. It's just getting more convoluted. You can now use dousing to locate the gate to the next trial. You should set a course for Laneru de Desert immediately. Now I can't say the correct name right. Uh, okay, so we're going to get interrupted by dou the dousing. And uh, I kind of fu find it funny how I mean... I don't know how else they would have done this, but it's just funny. Go that way. No, we're gonna go... I wonder what's down there. I really... Wait. Is there anything down here? At all? Uh... Um... Um... What? We touched the darkness. Okay, we're doing... I'm sorry, but we're doing that again. That was creepy. Also, those things look like swords. But that's just creepy. They didn't bother to prog program in the timeout function for the beetle. We're touching the darkness. That's amazing. Wow. They didn't bother to plant... Okay, if we jump off here, will it kill us? Okay, it will. But the beetle doesn't have a timeout thing, which is interesting. So, what happens if I throw bombs? Oh, it's just like, it's just like, um, it's just like Lake Floria, where you throw the bomb and it'll immediately blow up upon, upon hitting the stuff. What happens if we do this? I'm sorry for delaying this, but this is just interesting to me. Okay, so that, that, that's right, okay. That's weird, man. That's really weird. Huh. It reminds me of that glitch, which I have never seen anyone else who discovered this glitch. In um, Super Mario Sunshine, my sister was playing once, and she was, you know, she was playing Yoshi. She was on, um, she was on, uh, Pianta Village, or Pinta Village, and, you know the, you know the tree? that Pinta Village is on, well, she was on the tree, she was on the mushrooms below Pinta Village, and what happened is she fell down, 
But the funny thing is, is do this weird, crazy, random glitch. She didn't die. So she and Yoshi were walking on the darkness below Pianta Village. They were walking on the darkness. And, you know, they weren't dying. And they could just stay there. They walked all the way around. In fact, I have a video of it on my 3DS. They were walking around on it, too. And they were not dying. She had to literally quit the level because she couldn't die. There wasn't er any area where it actually registered that she died. It's really weird, and I don't know how to re-perform the glitch. Maybe you guys can post it in the comments, but it's just one of the coolest things, coolest glitches I've ever seen in a video game. I mean, I'm sure there are cooler ones out there, but it was pretty cool, I have to say. It's just one of those really cool things. That's that's just what that glitch reminded me of. I think I discovered another glitch like it. I can't think of what it is off the top of my head, but I did discover another cool glitch like that. So, what we want to do is we can't finish any side quest right now. We can't. I've tried in um, practice... I've tried in earlier takes of this episode. It wouldn't work. Instead, all we can do, all we can do is progress the fledge quest. So what we should do, what we need to do is talk to him. Hey there, Link. Thanks again for that stamina potion. Since you gave it to me, I've been doing push-ups like a machine. You'll see. I'll be tough as you. I'll be as tough as you in no time. So we want. After talking to him, what we want to do now is we want to go up here to the bazaar and we want to go buy a stamina potion so right in here we want to buy a stamina potion you are creepy sir okay buy a stamina potion and then we want to visit him in the night I actually won't cut to this because this episode's going to be short enough as is and lacking content because we're just going to be in in the sky for this episode and next episode we're going to go do the trial which oh my word that trial Ugh. it's not bad it's hard but um so I'm not going to be doing much cutting in here there there are going to be a couple points where I I should cut but there aren't they're going to be few and far between far between Actually, I should, should go this way. So, um, I... I kind of realized, you know, this LP, it's not almost over, but we're about halfway through the game, if not... Yeah, we're about halfway through. Also, I think there's a rupee in there. Yeah, there is. Um, we're about halfway through the game, and I kind of... I've been making plans for the next LP, I'm not going to say what it is, but I've been making plans for the next LP, and I'm pretty sure why I know the LP, I have a good idea what the LP after that will be, but after that, I have no idea, which kind of scared me, because it's probably going to be the end of summer when I'm done with the LP after the one, after this one, I think, I think, no, the LP after the one after this one. Does that make sense? I don't know. But it's going to be around the end of summer, and I don't know what LP I'm going to do after that. I know what I want to do, but I'm not sure what I should do to just make it seem, you know, so I'm not doing the same thing. I mean, I'm definitely not doing another, I'm probably not doing another Zelda game this year, unless it's a drastically different one. But, I don't know. We'll get back to that in a second. 56, ah, 55, 56, 57. Even in practice, I always started with 56 for some reason. So he's doing better. Ah, whew, I'm sweating up a storm. Good evening, Link. Why does he have all of his clothes on now? He should take, like, the the overshirt on off and the scarf and then, like, change to shorts or something because those baggy pants, those are not good for exercising. It's just like an oven. I've been training hard ever since we last spoke, but I still feel so sluggish. Maybe I've just run out of energy. <sighs> ah, Link, is that is that a stamina potion you're carrying? How can he x-ray through our pockets? 
Do you mind? Would you mind if I had some? Sure, take it all. Just please waterfall it. Really? Wow, thanks. I'll gladly take it then. His hair is bad. It's worse than mine. And he did waterfall. Good guy. Woohoo! That's the stuff! It's like a, refle uh, a refreshing str a splash of energy! Sometimes I worry, though. All this training and no results? How long do I need to train before I start, get it start to get stronger? What do you think, Link? How many push-ups do you think I need to do to get strong? It's not about numbers, dude. It's not about numbers? Of course! You mean I should just keep at it until I've forgotten how many I've done, right? Exactly. I guess that makes sense. Now that I know that, I'll definitely start getting stronger. Come back soon so you can see how I'm doing. Okay. Bye, bro. What was I saying? Oh, yeah, the next LP. So, um... Yeah, I'm not sure. Um, I have some ideas. Oh, man. Um, I... I shouldn't really say much right now because it's pretty far in the future. But... You know, I'm not quite sure what I'm going to do, though it's not going to be another Zelda game. I can tell you that much. And, though I, I should make a list. In fact, I need to do that, like, soon, maybe today. I'm kind of keeping this vague. So what we want to do is there are... There are three... There are three goddess chests on this on Skyloft right now that we can that we've unlocked but there are only two that we can actually get right now the other the um other one we're waiting on some stuff so waiting on some items so we will get the two and then we're going to also get two uh gratitude crystals so that's that's our agenda for this episode the first is a goddess chest right here Right there. Uh, I did that on purpose. It's right in here, and it is a silver rupee, I think. Silver rupee. I'm right. So there's that. And then we're going to face plant right here. Actually, I think face planting is a little bit faster than just using the sailcloth, maybe. I don't know. You guys can tell that. say that in the comments, too. Also, those stars are pretty, man. Hey, I wonder... I remember in, um, Wind Waker, I'm pretty sure that the stars in Wind Waker are actual, legit constellations. Now, are these the same? Are these constellations? I'm not sure. Are they? I, I honestly do not know. Interesting. I'm trying to look for Big Dipper, or Little Dipper, because those are the easiest to see in Wow Moon. Um, where are we going? Oh yeah, what we want to do is... Now, we don't have to jump up here, but we can, and I will. Also, because there are rupees here. So, what you want to do is jump off here, or just go in the water, now that we have the Water Dragon scale. And we can swim all the way through this tunnel down here. And up here. And there will be two chests in here. One of them will be a goddess chest. One of them won't. Let's get the non one first. And this one is also a silver rupee. And no, my, my commentary is not desynced. I'm actually, de I am predicting this before they appear. That's another thing. Um, oh, and a piece of heart. That's another thing. Um... I just got, I remember, you remember a couple episodes back when I was talking about, um, when I was talking about the thing I, the problem I had with Windows Live Movie Maker, also I'm not sure if I should have even talked about that, I don't know, but the problem I had with that, well, I got the Power Director 12, also I'm not sure if I should be saying this either, uh, the Power Director 12 trial version. And now I actually upgraded to the full version, so that's that's a cool thing. I haven't made, noticed many differences except the fact that I no longer have to get a window asking me if I want to buy it or just 
continue the trial. But that's... It's there. Also, can we go up here now that now that we have the tough beetle? T -t 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 tough beetle, tough beetle, coming at ya. T -t -t tough beetle, tough beetle, it's gonna get you all. No, we can't. We might be able to trick that out, but I actually don't want to. And that song I was singing was actually referencing a TV show I used to watch as a kid. You guys can guess which one. If you guys get that reference, I'll give you a a Swiss Army knife or something. Okay, so the first we want to go all the way through here, and also I never explained why we're here. Uh, there are two two gratitude crystals that we need to get. Um, one of them is we you want to go all the way to the end of the cave for both of them, because they're both at the end of the cave. Okay, so, Link. So let's go ahead and leave the cave, and the first one is right on our left, right as we exit. Right there. There. So there's one, and the other one... Ching! The other one is all the way down here. All the way down here in the cave that we, or the, the alcove that we rescued our Loftwing from Groose. So there's, we now have 41. Now we have two more gratitude crystals to get this episode before we actually end it. But first, because we have 40 and that's what Batro wanted, let's go, I'm going to go ahead and cut over to his, his house so we can see what reward we get. And here we are. Got one of my favorite items out, dealing with all the keys out there. Wait, can we? Wait. I know this does something. Oh, it's cool. He covers us off this wing. And actually, one thing I never noticed until a recent playthrough of this game is that um, his wings are actually blue, but he has, like, curtains on them. Also, you can kind of see a... A skull pattern on him. Yeah, it's kind of like a skull pattern on his cape. Also, this... I'm probably freaking him out. Okay, so Batro, or Beatrix. Oh, you've got... You get... There a lot... Uh, wow, he... He speaks weird. Oh, you've gathered quite a lot of gratitude crystals, haven't you? How magnificent. Please take this as a, a token of this demon's deepest appreciation. Gold rupee, that's it? Really? I was hoping something cool. Okay. You didn't... Also. Ugh. His tiny eyes, and they're really close together. You... Yeah, no, I'm leaving you alone. Okay, um, the last thing we want to do... This second to last thing we want to do this episode is one, I'm going to cut to when it is daytime, and we can go ahead and do something. Okay, here is the first part of what you want to do. First is when you're going to daytime, you want to talk to Beatrice. Oh, hello. You've decided to come see me at home. You're not trying to tell me I'm your special someone, are you? So that's a little bit weird, and let's go ahead and talk to her father real quick. Yo. Listen up, pal. I don't want you getting too familiar with my little rainbow. And you better keep your uh, your eyes to yourself, too, if you know what I mean. Sheesh, bro. All I'm doing is sleeping... Never mind. That would have just came out awkward. I'm just gonna sleep in their bed, and then just go till morning. So, what you want to do is you want to talk to Beatrice a lot. Because that is... Also, can we... Oh man. Okay, Nintendo missed opportunity. Missed opportunity. I could have read that journal and been all up like seeing what she was writing. <laughs> um uh, that kind of, that that sentence kind of threw my train of thought out of whack, but my train of thought my train of thought out of whack. 
So you want to talk to Beatrice a lot because apparent. Well, there she has to do with the quest. So you want to talk to her. Um, also, what, one thing I didn't say about Fledge is the potion that we gave him is the last potion he needs. Um, we just gonna we're just going to move on with the quest and probably after the next dungeon we can come back and he'll be he'll he'll have baked enough where we can do stuff which sounds really weird so first thing we're doing is we're getting our shield and the reason why I'm showing this is because this involves talking to her so if she said something different I wouldn't show it and also the fact that I want to stress the fact that you need to talk to her a lot, or else this is go this quest is going to be saved till very late game, and you don't want that to happen. So, um, let's go ahead and we're getting out the braced shield. Um, my schedule is thrown out a little a little bit out of kilter because I I normally like to have this shield in the Laneru region because I don't know I just do because that's like this is like the Farron shield, but. It didn't really work out, so... And also, it, it does still kind of work out, because this shield is still resistant to electricity, and electricity is the main thing you're going to have to be dealing with the, in the Laneru region. Um, so you wouldn't want to bring this. So, yeah, it still kind of works out. Bye. Bye to you, too. So let's go ahead. Another, the last thing I want to do is I'm going to go ahead and cut to the Lumpy Pumpkin, where we are going to sleep until night and get two gratitude crystals there be right back so nighttime um there are some fireflies over there if you want them but we're more interested in the also i just missed something but um we're more interested in the gratitude crystal that is here and then there is one gratitude crystal inside which i should have shown that one first so, let's go ahead and run inside. I will not cut, because cutting's for wimps, I guess. It's actually not, and it's actually a very useful means of showing off information. But it's for wimps in this episode, okay? So we're going to go ahead and run up here. It is right up here. Right there. And we have all but um, two or three hidden gratitude crystals? No. That's wrong. There are at least... Set, wait. No, no, no. We only have two gratitude crystals left. Only two hidden ones. So, yeah, that's pretty cool. And we can't get them now, so... We're doing very well. And, um... <clears throat> sorry about that. That'll actually be it for this episode. I... I'm not sure if this is a long episode because of all the wimpy cutting that I had to do, but if it is long, I'm sorry. If it's short, I'm sorry. If it's just right, um, I shouldn't be apologizing to you because you should have no complaints. So, I'll see you next time for another Pal Plays The Legend of Zelda Skyward Sword, where we will, will, I didn't say we might, or if we do this, we will go beneath the clouds over there. There. And we will do one of the trials and get a new gift and go to a dungeon. I'll see you guys next episode. Da 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 <laughs> <laughs>
da 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 Dippity, on here, who are on Haka Hiki Hiki on a mere moona. Good job, good job, Lipa, good job, Lipa, good, 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 good